Hello and welcome to MSI. So ngayon, gagawa naman tayo ng tutorial kung paano tayo makakapag-generate ng ating watch list using the email alerts generated by MSIX. Okay? So let's begin by going to Windows, opening charts, and right-click on MSIX and click on Analysis. So once na maklik niya yan, Bibigyan niya kayo ng Analysis tab. Okay. Dadali niya kayo dito sa Analysis tab. You have to change the date to current date, which is the 23rd. Make sure na yung range niya is from two dates and apply to all symbols. Then click on Explore. So na-explore na natin siya kanina. So meron na tayong data dito. Okay, so we have more than 260 datas or indicators na binibigay ng MSI analysis. And what we have to do now is to go to our email kasi magsisend siya ng email alerts. So ito na yung ating email alerts. Okay. So, based on this email alert, meron na kayong idea kung ano yung mga bibili nyo. So, because we are looking into buying, ang gagawin natin ngayon is to remove the stock codes na short, vol, uh, short yung um, signal niya. Short or sell. So, we'll have to remove that para mas lumiit yung ating um, range. So, importante din itong mga short uh, alerts na to kasi pag nagkaroon na ng shorting, possible na magamit natin to for buying. Okay. So another thing na tatanggalin natin is yung mga um, data with this symbol. Okay? Yung parang up arrow symbol and yung mga stocks na ayaw niyo i-trade or sa tingin niyo hindi niyo naman talaga siya i-trade. So, let's remove some Yung green is an old, uh, this is an old uh, chart. Okay, so make sure that you are looking at uh, stocks that are dated August 23. Okay, so this one will not be trading that. Okay, so na, na limit na natin yung ating um, watch list to... Let's count it off. From here. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34. Let's say we have around 34 uh, stocks right now in our watch list. So from 260 down to 34, ngayon we'll have to go and look at the charts. Okay, isa-isahin natin siya para makahanap tayo ng play. So actually dito sa analysis, pwede nyo itong gawin. Pwede nyo i-right click, i-float nyo siya para pwede nyo may adjust yung data. Okay? Pwede nyo i-adjust yung data ng ganyan. Tapos, pag nag-double click kayo sa chart, sa name ng stock, 
actually, papalitan niya yung data niya dito. So, no need to type, just double click. Pwede niyo nang check yung, yung chart niyo. Kung pwede ba siyang laruin or hindi. Okay? But for now, we will be using our um, email alert. Okay, so this is our email alert. We have our charts open. Then we'll find the profitable setup. So let's start with ABS. ABS, do we have a setup? Yes, it's possible. Kasi nag-hold siya above the um, above this RSI 49. And we can also have a box here this area okay so sa current setup niya um, current setup niya is RS uh, sorry um, ABS is um, near the 50% Darvas yan yung red line actually nakulog na siya ng konti pero RSI is still uh, strong so we can have a possible play there. So, pwede natin i-add yan sa watch list natin. And ABS is also orange color. Yung sinabi ko dati, the color of the stock will give you an indication kung uptrend, downtrend, or sideways yung stock. So, right now, it's on a sideways. So, pwedeng magkaroon ng Another uptrend movement or downtrend movement. So we can add this on our watch list. Another thing to consider is dapat merong um, tradable range. Okay, so yung tradable range or your profit range niya is only 2.4%. Uh, so I'd pass on this one. Then we'll move to rock. Rocks, ayaw ko yung chart niya. It's still a downtrend. Then we have T. T is a green candle. It's, an, it's still on an uptrend. Kaya lang. Um, bagsak yung uh, RSI niya. So I wouldn't be trading this also. Okay, then we have X. X looks like nagkaroon ng bounce. So, there is a tradable range of 11.5%. Uh, so, yes, we can add this in our um, we can add this in our uh, watch list under uh, bottom picking maybe. So, it could be a bounce play um, and your target will be to reach 11.5%. Then VVT, VVT, I don't think it's a, it's a tradable stock. This is a tradable stock because liquidity wise and yung, yung uh, candlesticks niya hindi mo rin maintindihan. So might as well not study it and trade it. Then we have SM. Uh, SM right now is above the support levels of 918 and also above the Darvas box DB50 at 930. So possible target, first target is 953. Then your next target will be 986. So this is a 5% profit double trade so yes it's possible looking at the philippine stock index also it's moving upward so it's you can put it in your um in your watch list okay then we can we have scc okay scc we have a 10 percent um 10 percent 
target price here from the current price but uh, i would wait for this to be above at least 30.35 or break the 30.5 level much better to break the 30.5 level magkakaroon na rin siya ng um, counting strength sa RSI niya then you can put this on your watch list okay so I wouldn't be going through all the stocks here same medyo madami siya so this is just how you can make your watch list based on the buy and sell signals so it doesn't mean that if it gives you a buy signal it's already a good buy you still need to do your checking with your other indicators okay so thanks for watching